I'm Julia Day, and I'm sitting here with Henry and Bradley. Henry and Bradley, could you tell us just for a second a little bit about the song that we just heard? Okay. Um, that was Settled Down off of my EP Mooney. that came out last October. I wrote it a few years ago during like a pretty hectic personal time. Um, I was like moving around a lot between Alabama and Utah where where I live half the year and I don't know I think it um speaks to just like the chaos of my life at a certain point of time Bradley I'd love to hear a few words from you about this particular song the one that we just heard settled down Yeah I would say that settled down is the closest thing that we have to kind of a pop like we call it a banger, I think, but mm-hmm. it's, you know, compared to some of the other stuff, it's like got the most pop appeal, I think. It's one of your most popular songs, isn't it? Yeah, I think that's why, too. It's just I think it's got the most beat. It's probably the most beat driven out of anything that we're playing. So, so Henry, I've learned that a lot of your uh, that a lot of the inspiration that you experience musically comes from connecting with nature, hiking skiing. Can you talk a little bit about that? Okay. Yeah. Um, for for half the year, I live in Utah. I work as a ski instructor and I on skis just like in nature every day. So I don't, I tend to th- come up with a lot of my ideas while I'm outdoors, like on the mountain in the snow. It's just really peaceful and a lot of inspiration can strike pretty easily when you're just surrounded by a bunch of natural beauty. I find it really, really interesting. The the one major contrast I've learned about the two of you is that, um, Bradley, I learned that you're very formally trained as a musician. And Henry, I've heard you say that you would not consider yourself a formally trained musician. <laughs> not at all. And <laughs> Absolutely not. So I'm super curious to hear what you'd have to say about kind of the hospitality of the current musical landscape with regard to being a formally trained musician versus not being a formally trained musician. Okay, sure. I think now it's just so much easier to learn enough about music to where you can be creative just because of YouTube and just the internet in general. It's easy to pretty much learn how to learn enough to express yourself, but um, I still think formal training just gives you all the tools to be able to better articulate whatever your vision is. Yeah, I would probably say that there's a a certain different approach that Henry takes to music than I take to music, but there's also an inherent bias in the kind of formal training of music in, at least in America, like a Western, like the European classical tradition, which is a pretty narrow scope of music. So sometimes where from being in school, 
my head is stuck in that stuff. It's really interesting to work with someone like Henry who is working in a pure sense. Like it's purely coming from what he's feeling and what he's hearing, like his, his ideas that he has. And who doesn't have that bias that you were referring to. Oh yeah. 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 Cause he, yeah, he, his, he can do things that, um, I could never, I mean, I could never write the music that he writes, you know, I would mess it up. And even when we're working on it from a production standpoint, it's like my tendency is uh, development, right? Like we have an idea, then we have to like develop it right away. Whereas he's sometimes it's like, he wants to do the least amount of thing that you could possibly do. Uh, but it works because of that. Like I, w you know, because he's, he leans into it so much and he, and is so inspired. Right. Well, the music that you guys create together is refreshingly spare. There's not a lot of extra things going on. It's not cluttered at all. Is there anything else you'd like to leave our audience with? Any thoughts as we close our session here? Um, just thanks to Parseco for having us. We love, love coming here. love hanging out, playing music in such a beautiful space. Thank you guys for sitting with me. Absolutely, thank you.